Hi, Larry here again at Chesapeake RV Solutions, your home of the RV warranty for life. Today we're going to be doing this walkthrough of this Highland Ridge, Mesa Ridge 379 FBS. New for 2023 Highland Ridge, using new graphics for their Mesa Ridge line. And also, if you notice the front cap, this is actually a painted front cap, not gel coat, so you don't have to worry about it fading. And also it is pre-wired for Furion side view cameras. And the level lock system that they use is JT Strong Arms that actually takes out a whole lot of the wobble going back and forth and some people do the tripods which I still don't know how that's supposed to work but these are on each individual jack front and rear another thing I like this actually has three 20 pound propane tanks they're stored inside they do have this sliding tray in and out so you can get to them real easily two will be on this side one will be on the other side one thing I do like the size of this pass-through plenty of room for storage also you can come up from the bottom your coax and GFI receptacle or your receptacles out here as well so if you want to do a TV out here you could but bring all the wiring through so you can actually shut those doors also if you want to carry a grow with you you do have a separate propane line your exhaust for your furnace also this does have the four step Lippert solid step. One thing I like that landing step is a little bit bigger than the rest, a little bit safer coming out. Also, instead of having pins for your adjustable feet, these are actually spring loaded, which makes it a whole lot easier when you're setting up. Also, this is your main slide. This is a 42 inch deep slide, also AccuSlide. They have a triple seal, so you can have this open in any position and it won't have any leaks or drafts, so you can have it halfway open if you needed to. This is one thing I like, there's one key that opens everything and it is key to like. Also you do have pre-wired uh, Wi-Fi or for a router. Also, three-year structural warranty. This is a four-season unit, so it does have the four-season protection package. And it does have the Dexter Never Adjust Easy Lube Axles. And the brass fittings there. This one actually came with factory installed slide top covers. You do have the automotive windows or frameless windows on this unit as well. Nice size windows. This is also wired for a rear observation camera. It does have a ladder going up to the roof. This does have a PVC membrane roof that has a lifetime warranty. Now it does have a hitch back here, two inch receiver, and it's actually wired. And this can actually tow behind it 3,000 pounds with a 300 pound tongue weight. And again, on the north non door side, you'll notice another slide topper here. 50 amp service. This is, does have two ACs. Next thing, this does have a heat pump on the main AC. Another look at the graphics. This is actually your 
compartment doors for your Insignia range, your Whirlpool refrigerator. Your water heater, of course. And another nice thing is this is enclosed. And again, everything coming up from the bottom. You do have your fresh water connection, your two black tank flushes. This does have a bath and a half. You also have a light out here. Your plumbing settings also makes it real easy to do your winterization, your cable going in and out. And you do have a GFI receptacle and a light in there as well. And a non door side pass through. Your other propane tank. This does have three 20 pound tanks, of course. JT Strong Arms. One thing as well. You do have cable actuated drop valves for your gray and your black tanks. This is heated underbelly. And this is a true four season unit. Again with the AccuSlide system, the new graphics. Also you do have your self-leveling control, auto level. You do have your battery disconnect and your inverter for your Whirlpool residential refrigerator. This one actually does come with two batteries because of the refrigerator. You can run it going down the road. Then you do have your Rhino Box Kingpin. Here's one thing, again, like the slide toppers, pre-wired for the Furion cameras. Most campers will come with that being an open window. You have to buy the blind. This actually already comes with the blind. Also another nice thing that it has, and this is a slingshot, but it will automatically close your screen door. This also has LED lights against the wall on your awning. Also, this is a JBL sound system, so you do have JBL exterior speakers as well. Now, as we go inside, you'll notice you do have a max air vent here you also have one in your bathroom but you also have one in your living area hard countertop on your kitchen island farm sink split between your cutting board and your drain rack nice black plumbing fixtures does have the pull down handle plenty of storage space underneath and somewhere to put your trash can this also comes with the two tablet sized tables for the recliners over there or theater seating you do have a tri-fold couch that makes into a uh, full or queen size bed. Also, the slide is actually seven foot high. Hardwood fascia going around. The AccuSlide system is a flush floor slide no trip hazards also this slide is 42 inches deep gives you more living space and you do have your day blind K 
keeps your furniture from getting sun bleached and your MCD blackout blind nice windows on your campsite heated and massage recliners that's where your tables will go and they do have lights underneath there however we're not hooked to shore power so I can't show you that right off you also have over overhead cabinets more storage and one thing if you notice this doesn't have a cutout for your AC in the ceiling but it does have two returns like your residence would have this is actually the second generation of AC so it's about 70% quieter than the old systems and the main AC is 15k but it also has a heat pump I also like this floor plan there's different versions of it but this we ordered with the rear dinette I think this is really nice and we'll back up a little bit we do have the leaf extended on that table and these are actually 22 inch wide seats but this is actually what I like is the strut there to hold your chairs in place when you're going down the road. And you can set it up as a bench seat if you're trying to fit four people there or actually five people with the leaf out. And again, nice size windows in the back. Love that rear dinette. You do have a 50 inch smart TV. And of course, they're using every space possible. So you do have storage behind the TV. And it's on struts. Extra storage below the TV. Your JBL sound system. Your fireplace. Of course, it's aesthetically pleasing, but it does put out 5,000 BTU in combination with the heat pump on the main AC. I don't think you'll have to use a furnace at all, especially not in this area. And one thing, they do have the tile that is actual tile not just wallpaper they gave you more counter space on the other side of the range system there and this is an insignia which is probably the largest that I've ever seen in an RV you have four burner stove top each burner has a different BTU and you actually have two shelves in there you can, or you could have, cooked a turkey in there for Thanksgiving. This being Cyber Monday. And I like that tile and the extra counter space. One thing they did, they used to have a pantry over here, but now they put your pantry over here. Which is a nice size. And, of course, your 21 foot, 21 cubic foot Whirlpool refrigerator. Again, bigger than the one I have at my house. And your freezer. Very nice.
bit of overhead storage there. This new decor is called Greystone, which really gives you a nice interior design. And I like the lights above the kitchen or the uh, island kitchen. That is a 30 inch convection microwave oven. As if that stove isn't big enough. But you do have extra cooking in there. These are also 75 pound ball bearing drawer glides. Do you have a little bit of storage down there? nice half bath and you do have another upgraded fan in here it has a rain gauge as well so if it's raining it will close it automatically porcelain toilet nice size vanity your medicine cabinet place for extra storage. Underneath your sink. GFI receptacle. You have a towel rack. I do like the black fixtures. Now You also have a jacket closet. Here's your wall control, but you can actually set this up with Bluetooth for your phone. It does have the travel link, so you can control everything from your phone. And coming into the bedroom, you can see your light switch. You do have light switches on the wall, but you also have those that you can turn on and off individually as a night light, or say if you're reading. This is a king size bed. There's your three 20 pound propane tanks. Of course we have an open lot, so we try to put everything inside. You do have the daylight, daytime, and nighttime blinds again on each window. You have struts to hold your bed up. Plenty of room for storage. This does come with the curly blue hose with an actual nozzle on the side. So if you're trying to clean something on the outside. Yeah. And... Another nice thing, I know on the outside you may have been asking yourself, what does that little slide hold? Well, you do have your dresser on this side. You can put a TV right there in the middle. This does have the coax. You also have one of those pop-up receptacles, USB ports as well. A little desk if you want to do a laptop or a computer up there for those remote workers. Also, 80 pound, excuse me, 75 pound drawer glides. 
nice amount of storage or clothes you can put in there. And plenty of windows again. Your vanity. Turn on the light switch. Nice size vanity. You do have your mirror there as well. This does have the porcelain foot flush toilets and another max air vent. So you actually have three, two in your bathrooms and then one in your living space. This is a residential style shower. The nice thing they added this year is that shelf for any shampoo bottles or however conditioner or whatnot. It's a walk-in shower. And do you have a seat over there? Extra space for towels and whatnot. Now, this is the walk-in closet. Yes, I can walk in this. You have GFI receptacles over there for your washer and dryer setup. But this is the biggest closet I've ever seen in an RV. Plenty of shelves for storage. Wow, you just have caught up here. Make extra sleeping if you wanted to. Very nice. And this is actually out of the way where you can set up your router. It is pre-wired. And this does have the two ACs. And you do have your returns like your residence would have. And it does make it quiet compared to the ones that have the cutouts for the AC right in your ceiling. Give it another look as I go through and set some of these lights off. King size bed again. Love that dresser and vanity. Also, you do have receptacles on either side of your island. Also, you do have LED strip underneath your kitchen island. light switch for your overhead lights. That's a nice look. Love that rear dinette again. Plenty of windows. Seven foot high main slide. It is 42 inches deep. No carpet whatsoever other than a little bit of up your stairway. Hope you enjoyed this walkthrough of this Mesa Ridge 379 FBS. If you have questions about it or any other that we have on a lot, please come by and see us or give us a call. Also, here at Chesapeake RV Solutions, we're here to help you create the memories you will talk about forever. 
Thank you.